thank you so much for stopping by so today i am already jazzed up and all this thing i have created with makeup product that comes under only 200 rupees now uh, like last year i actually did a video where i have used like makeup products which comes under 500 rupees which i will link up here so that actually like liked by you guys so 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 much so that's what exactly inspired me to create this look without further ado let's just jump right in so to prime my face i am using lactic alamine now everybody knows that it is great for skin and uh, lactic alamine is also pretty good option as makeup primer then for my foundation i am reaching out to my blue heaven uh, matte foundation now guys i don't really like this foundation i mean you will see see why i say this i mean look at the shade it is just so off and um, i am going to blend it out with a beauty sponge which i always do with all of my foundation but you will see that what i'm talking about when i am actually trying to blend it out it is actually giving me ball patches all over my uh, face as if the foundation is getting so too much and it's just revealing my real skin texture also it has like zero coverage it gives you a coverage just like a bb cream just look at my face is looking so orange so i need to fix this so that's why i am going in with my trusted maybelline super stay foundation with a uh, Nykaa Skin Genius Sculpting and Hydrating Foundation 2. So I just have mixed them both and I'm applying it all over my face. So I mean, you can see the difference what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> Next to set my under eye, like I am using this palette. Now, uh, the exact name and everything I will mention in the description box. I got this from Amazon and this one actually retails for 150 rupees. So I'm just applying the concealer right under my uh, under eye with the first and then I am blending it out with my beauty sponge. The coverage is really good. I mean, it's a real decent product, but uh, like I don't really reach out to this product very often because it has a very weird smell to it and you guys know i don't really like makeup products which comes with a certain fragrance so yeah that is there now to set my face off i am going to uh use like johnson baby powder now you guys know i always use this whenever i am feeling like lazy to reach out to my real setting powders or even i use it during my body paint or uh, like face paint just to set everything off bb powder can actually work really great as your baking powder so just try that out now i have done my brows and uh, my face contouring off camera i didn't really have any brow pencil under 100 bucks in my collection but there are plenty so don't you worry about that so now i am just going to apply a little bit more bronzer so for that i am using this blue heaven blush this actually is a blush but look at the shade how dark it is i mean it is really pigmented but it is not really uh for my skin tone now for my eyes i am using this swiss beauty sapphire uh eyeshadow palette this is a big eyeshadow palette and i am going to swatch the shades these four are from from the top row and these four are from the bottom row you guys can see how beautifully pigmented they are so first i'm taking this shade and just lightly uh, applying it with a fluffy brush onto my crease now i know in this palette there are all shimmer shadows there are no matte shadows but whoever thinks that uh, shimmer shadows can't really create a proper look i don't really agree with them you can create amazing eye looks with all shimmery shadows so don't you worry about that so yeah, I'm just here, I am just deepening my crease out a bit, then I'm reaching out to this color and just blending it further more up to my brow bone. You guys can see like how pigmented they are when they are dry. I am going to use them as uh, wet as well. So when you are going to use big eyeshadows, all you need to do is just scrape some from the eyeshadow palette and just spray your fixing spray or just normal water and then just apply it with your fingertips on your eyelids and bam you will get like thousand person color now just 
just to blend it further more i am just using a fluffy blending brush and blending everything together next for my eyelid i am taking this beautiful green and blue undertone kind of shadow and i have actually uh, added some water and just look at it that's what exactly i was talking about just look at the pigmentation guys and this eyeshadow palette actually retails for 149 rupees i got it from amazon and i'm just spellbound to deepen up the outer corner and the inner corner of my eyelid i am taking this shade right here and just applying it with my fingers and this shade also is a little bit wet to blend it everything nicely i am taking a small blending brush and just uh creating a cohesive look so for my lower lash line also i am dragging down those two same colors but i'm not really using them wet i am using them dry now to add some more chunky glitters i am taking this um beautiful glitter eyeliner from swiss beauty again and it has a very nice like green uh, aqua green kind of tone you guys can see how pretty it looks whenever you are patting it down with your finger because i want those uh, chunky glitters to be shown so that's why i am just like dabbing it on my eyelids in this eyeliner i think i got for 130 rupees everything and the shade and the shopping link will be mentioned in my description box so don't miss that out Highlight my inner corner. I am taking this shade and just lightly applying in my uh, inner corners. Now I have actually tight lined my lower lash line with a blue eye pencil, and now I am just adding a thin liner uh, from the NYX eyeliner. Actually, the uh, here I am not actually showing the product because these two products doesn't really come under hundred rupees. They are a little bit costlier side, so that's why I am not showing the product. Today I am going to use a pair of false lash, of course, and that is uh, from the company called Miss Claire, and I got it for only one seventy five rupees. So I have applied my false. lashes now for my lower lash line i'm using this lacme iconic mascara it actually comes under 200 not under 200 it actually retails for exact 200 rupees and it is a blue mascara like it's just amazing i love colorful makeup and an indian brand such as lacme has come up with a blue mascara i just had to purchase it <laughs> now uh, after all of now uh, when my eyes are done i just thought that my highlighter is not uh, highlighting enough so what i thought that i'll just apply very little amount of eye shadow on my cheekbones but you can see like how intense this swiss beauty uh, eye shadow palette is now to finish off this look i am using this blue heaven a uh, liquid lipstick it is really nice this is a very nice uh, nude shade but the only problem is the this is not something that i ordered for the one i ordered for that was looking very different on nika but uh, in reality it looks like this so yeah that's again a bummer for me after that i am just setting everything off with my uh, setting spray now this setting spray is doesn't really come under 200 rupees so that's why i'm not showing it but if you want you can opt for the swiss beauty one there are options but i am not really sure about the quality okay so <laughs> so i didn't really wanted to spill the tea right from the beginning but now i have shown all the products let me give you my final verdict to be very honest i don't really like my face it's just looking very very caked up you guys have seen me when i was just applying uh, the blue heaven foundation which is like this it was like basically it was not getting applied evenly i don't know what is wrong with that i actually have done a proper two day review of this uh, uh foundation that i'm trying it out on my instagram it is if you guys are not following me on instagram please 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 follow me on instagram it is there on my highlights so that's why just to make it even i had to apply two more different foundations so that's why my base got so caked up apart from that i also purchased um a blusher uh, from blue heaven again the shade card is really really off for blue heaven let it be foundation let it be the lipstick let it be the blusher uh, the blusher i purchased it was looking in nika like some kind of a peachy tone but when it came 
let me just show it to you. Yeah. So when it just came, uh, it actually looks like this. Like it's very very dark and not for my skin tone. And the packaging is really flimsy. I think I bought it for hundred rupees, like uh, below actually hundred rupees. And uh, so is for the lipstick. I mean the lipstick, the color is like pretty okayish. However, what is the most important thing? I do I recommend all these things to you? Not really. I am very very happy with this Swiss Beauty um, eyeshadow palette. So this is the look that I have created with the palette, and I just love the palette how it looks. It's like all of them are big eyeshadow. If you uh, use them as dry, you are going to get like a light shimmer kind of effect, and if you're going to use it like wet. You guys can see how intense uh, it has become. Again, I like uh, the Swiss Beauty products. I mean, uh, the liner also I really, really like. And uh, what I really like about Swiss Beauty products is they have actually like transparency. Their ingredients are mentioned over here. I would just give some brownie points to them. Whereas in this Blue Heaven products and the uh, color correcting palette, which just I have used. There is no mention of uh, the ingredient list, and also this foundation actually caused me like pimples. So yeah, I do not really recommend any of these products, guys. Like I know uh, everybody can't afford like really luxury products, but it's makeup, and you are actually applying it on your skin, on your eyes. So just just make sure that you invest in good. Products. There are really good, affordable drugstore products out there in the market. Don't play around all these products. There's, they are just. I I did this makeup because of the challenge, like 200 rupees makeup challenge. That's why I did it. I don't really know whether I'm going to keep them or just tell them bye bye. So that was just it. So if you like this video, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.